Hey, I'm Cody. Hey, I'm Paddy. Hey, I'm Sam. And we're here with UQ Medicine. Boys, Sam. question is, what is the average weight of the human brain? Is it A, 500 grams, B, 1.4 kilograms, C, 3.2 kilograms? All right. Well, what is the answer? I know this one too, I've studied this before. <laughs> B. If I remember rightly. Just put your house what was, Sorry, what was, what was C? 3.2 kilograms. And what was B? 1.4 kilograms. <laughs> I'm going, I'm going B. To be honest, I'm going B as well. I got him right, first. Majority rule. What do you got? Then. What's the answer? The answer is, gentlemen, it's B. Oh, say no more. Wow. Yeah. With all bright. <laughs> it's easy though. The human brain weighs an average of 1.4 kilograms and is the largest brain of all vertebrates relative to the body size. Really knew that. Yeah. Yeah. FYI. <laughs> um, I'll give you the next question, mate. Too easy. <laughs> Boys, a recent UQ study found that having more than three of these items in your eye could indicate a higher chance of melanoma. Oh, yeah. You know what that is? You're not melanoma? Is? Yeah, I do. What is it? But I'm asking the question. Yeah, what is it? So you tell me after. What is it? <laughs> Which item is it? A, eyelashes, B, blood vessels, C, freckles. So what was the uh, question again? Mm. Melanoma. Melanoma, mate. Do you know what a melanoma is? Yeah. High cancer. High chance of melanoma. I'm going C. Mm. Eyelashes, blood vessels, or freckles? I'm going, going B. C. Yeah, I'm going B too, actually. <laughs> actually, no, I'm going to go C. I'm going to go A. Eyelashes. Oh, right. So you got A, B, C. You know? Yeah, well, I'm yeah, B. Yeah, look at that. And the answer is? C. B. It's C. <laughs> yeah. C. Yeah. <laughs> University of Queensland researchers have found that freckles and moles appearing on the iris indicate a higher risk of melanoma, particularly in people under 40 years of age. Wow. What's the iris, Cody? Thank you, gentlemen. Well, you're over 40 now, so you're, are you safe? Yeah. Do you have freckles in your eyes? Um, I don't no, I don't. So. <laughs> I hope not. <laughs> yeah, look. Please point out your pinna. <laughs> no good. Okay. Oh, this is the question. Yeah. You ready? Yeah. Please point out your pinna. Pinna. Yeah. <laughs> P I double N A. Pinna, pinna, pinna. Okay. Are you pointing it out now? Is yeah, it I think I've got it. It's, I think it's in here. Yeah, I'm going. Nah, just made that up. All right. Nah, I'm going in here. Yeah. <laughs> you must have been. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. You, know, you see it? Nah, nah I didn't nah. see it. Nah. I'm going here. <laughs> I trust him. He's smart. <laughs> Don't do it. He OP1. He's smart. <laughs> Don't do it. Yeah, I'll go here. Yeah, we all went here. <laughs> it's here. Yes! <laughs> yeah, the boys. That is busy. Nice. Yeah, nice. Um, okay, so that's the, the pin is the visible part of the ear and it's the first part of the ear that reacts with sound. It works for funneling sound further into your ear. Yep. Okay. Should have waited till we pointed it out first. Yeah. For funny. the boys. Yeah. So Question four, boys. Thanks to a UQ virologist, we will soon have a new emoji that represents the world's most dangerous animal. <laughs> wow. Which animal is it? A. Mosquito. B. Box jellyfish. C. Saltwater crocodile. I'm gonna go A. I'm going A too. I'll tell you my reason why afterwards. I'll tell you my reason why afterwards as well. I'm going to take. Oh. I reckon I'm 4 from 4 here. I'm, I'm going B. I'm some chance. I'm, 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 I'm going B. I'm going A. I'm going B. You've just created ABBA. No, I'm going A. No, I'm going B. So you know yeah, you, you created go, ABBA. Can you see ABBA? <laughs> yeah. yeah. What's the answer? The answer is... Hey, oh. Oh. What's, your, what's your reasoning? What's I just your reasoning? knew. I just what knew. What's your reasoning? You're going to be angry. Oh, sorry. <laughs> 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 yeah. Smart of this, man. Yeah. Right. What's the reason? Yeah, well, okay. Mosquitoes affect millions of people around the world okay. each year by spreading um, a host of infections. Um, the Mozzie Moji will give health professionals and academics a more relatable way to communicate health risks and new research using social media. Well done, Ooh. guys. Well, I like you, the Mozzie. Do you reckon you guys would use a Mozzie emoji? Um, to be honest, yeah, like I would send it to someone who's annoying. Oh, yeah. You know? Yeah. Mosquitoes, they're annoying. What's your most used emoji? Mine's Spine, the one. Yeah. Face, yeah. Nah, mine's the tongue one. 
the wink yeah, and the tongue. Yeah, one. the wink and the tongue. Yeah. I love that one. Ah, uh, Christian Five, you are really good. No, you stay on it. You're good at it. You sure? Yeah, yeah. Oh, right I'd like to hand pass it around. Mm. Question. It's estimated but that by 2025, 8 out of 10 people will be overweight or obese. To combat this, the Australian Medical Association suggests we put a tax on A. Red meat, B. Avocados, C. Sugary drinks. Ooh, Are you serious? That's the easy answer. Avocados. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like it's like one of those ones where you think it's the sugar drinks, yeah. but then it's going to be like red red avocados or something. But I'm just going to say C. No, I'm C. 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 The answer is yeah. C. Easy one. A tax on sugary drinks. One 375 ml of can of soft drink contains 10 teaspoons of sugar, which is almost twice the suggested daily intake tax. There you go. No, you just keep answering because I'm doing good. No, no, you're good at reading. Keep going. No, I'm not. Okay. Okay, guys, question six. What is the axilla? Huh? Tip. Spell it. Spell it. What is it? A X I double L A. A X I double L. Oh, yes, yes. Say that right. Axilla. Yeah. Axilla. Yeah. Tip. It can be smelly. So I think that must be a giveaway. Could it be A, foot? B, belly button. C, armpit. Ooh. 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 Yeah. Um. Axilla. Axe. You think of axe, you think of belly button. <laughs> <laughs> no, you don't. It's A. <laughs> what are you guys going, boys? I'm going feet first. I'm going belly button. I'm going feet. I'm going, I'm going C. Nah, I'm going armpit. I'm going C, armpit. Back yourself. Ready? Oh, He's ready? Go. Okay, you read out A. C, C, oh, C. Like this. Yeah. Answer is. <laughs> Answer is C. Is it actually? It is. It's C. The axilla is more commonly known as the armpit. Yeah. Smelly feet, eh? <laughs> Smelly feet. <laughs> All right, brother. You got the last axilla. one. Axilla. <clears throat> what is the largest organ in the human body? A. Large intestine. B. Skin. C. You won't liver. Say, you won't say skin. Wow. I'll say skin. What do you say? Largest organ. Right, I'll say it because you said to say it. Alright, go then. Right, so B. I'm saying skin. I'm saying I, A. Alright, I'm going C. Honestly. Okay. You want me to say it? Yeah, go on. I'm I'll say C. skin. Go, okay, I'm going C. Sure? Yeah. You can change. Do you want to go skin? No. If you get skin, you win. No. Okay. The answer is B. Oh. The skin. The average person's skin covers an area of two square meters and plays a vital role in regulating body temperature and protecting muscles, bones, and internal organs. Oh, that sounds good. Cool. There you go. You would study that, eh? Yeah, but I won. Yeah. How did you win? I won. Who Video won? shows I won. So I we're. Oh, oh, yeah! And he went to uni. Yeah! Yeah, the physio. Do I have to read the question? Uh, well, we gotta. Um, every year, approximately one in every five Australians will experience. A, itchy elbows, B, sinus infections, or C, mental illness. Ooh. Is that out of me and him now? Yeah. Hi, C. Yeah, I'm going C. Oh, well. Mental illness. Mental illness. He's in first. Yeah, you're both right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. do another one now. Yeah. Another one. Another one. Yeah. Another one. Yeah. First one to answer. Wait, is it first then? Okay. This is popularity, not um, smartness. True or false? Your nose cleans the air you breathe. False. True. Okay, it is true. <laughs> <laughs> so there's little small hair like a pen. Yeah, that's not either. Yeah, that's true. You just went against the grain. That's not really good. Wow. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> you didn't pick up the sound. You got it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> The hair scraps the contaminants, but then it covers it with papers and it gets sent back into your stomach. I don't know what you said, but it seems. Oh, no. <laughs> so, yeah. not to do a good job of cleaning, but apparently your stomach can deal with the bacteria. So, is that, is, that, is that the nose of the nose? Is that the nose? Is that the dog of the nose? One of the jobs. Okay. So, you have it. Winner, winner. Chicken yeah. dinner. Oh my god. <laughs> 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 Chicken dinner. Oh my god. Chicken dinner. Chicken dinner.